lovely rainy morning here in Annapolis, Maryland. Yesterday we got two inches of PWI. Been hearing a lot of geese out there. I think they're loving it. Hey everybody, Gil with Destination Outdoors. How are y'all doing today? I am dodging raindrops, trying to figure out what to do today. I do got to get started on my van upgrades, which I think I'm going to try to get that started today. Um, that's a couple things around the house to do, but uh, I want to rip the couch out of the back of the van because it's not a very good bed when it does lay down. And it gives me no storage up underneath, so I'm going to redo that. I'm going to take that out. And I'd like to get the carpet off the flooring so I could put uh, like some kind of laminate down. I like solid surface flooring in the van. I think it's a little bit better for what I do hiking and stuff, tracking mud in and out. It's, it's the way to go. So uh, that's on my agenda today. Uh, as you can see, it's, it's going to be something indoors, whether it be me in the van or me in the house. Hope everybody else is having a little better weather where they're at. But, uh, let's hang out. Hey, how's it going, everybody? Gil with Destination Outdoors. Uh, here to start my my van upgrades. Um, I have a 2004 Ford Econoline 150 conversion van. Um, it's in pretty good shape. I mean, it's a little older model, but my mother owned it and it uh, took, you know, took good care of it. So I'm going to convert it and use it for my travels. First off, we got to take seats out. I want to remove these two seats here. And I want to remove that back bench seat as well. Uh, the bench seat's going to go away permanently. It, the way it's designed, it's got steel up underneath of it. Um, you really have no storage. Um, I can stuff stuff behind it, but I want to use the full area. And then when it's laid out into a bed, it's not really comfortable for bed uses. So we're going to do something different back there. And I'd like to get the carpet out of here. It's got the original, I mean it's, it's seen a little bit better days, and not to mention with trying to use this van for traveling, I do a lot of hiking and I own a, a fat tire bike. I get a little muddy sometimes and I think a solid surface floor, like I said earlier, is just it's the way to go in here. So um, we're going to be gutting that as carpet out as well. First thing first, got to take these seats out of here. Get the bench out. Got the carpet. Let's uh, make some headway.
All right, everybody. Got some headway today. Got the seats all out. As you see, my carpet is up. I uh, need to take a couple measurements, get some plywood picked up this week, and I will uh, try to get a, a plywood base down, something to put my laminate on. It's pretty nice that this black foam's down on the floor. That's going to uh, make a little less insulation I need. This floor is in great shape still. There's no rust. I just got to plug the holes from where the seats were. But uh, but other than that, that's it. It's actually turning out to not, hopefully, cross my fingers, it's going to be a pretty decent job. I'll get some floor put back in here, and we'll work from there. We'll get some cabinets put in, get a little bed put back in here, and uh, make it like a totally just a weekender. So, uh, yeah, thank you all for watching today. This is going to be part one. I'll have some more installments on this. This is going to be a process. So, uh, hope you all keep tuning in. If you got some suggestions, let me know. Drop them in the comments. Um, you know, subscribe, hit like if you liked it. Thank you all. See you next time.